country to have lost a, a, a true uh, dedicated member of the royal family. His amazing years of service to our country and support You're bringing, you're bringing him uh, lilies, huh? Lilies, yes. But I wanted the colours. It's beautiful my colour. I brought it from a colour. But I wanted to bring any flowers. And unfortunately, there was not much one could buy, so I had to bring the things. Thank you very much, huh? Thank you. Thank you. Number one fan of the royal family, we love them. And if they're watching, all our love goes out to them. That's cool. A lot of people find it very sad. I think it's quite, quite an outdated system in a way. And maybe this is a catalyst to start something new. So. Fraternisation into Hamburg, so we see the roof on to the barrier, getting wet, getting hot. We should be dancing in Hamburg, we're almost finished now. surreal. Um, Prince Philip is an individual that's been in our lives, certainly mine, as a generation, my father's generation, and now my son's generation. And uh, it's one of those days, you know, that I guess you will remember the same way I remember the death of Diana. It was a shock. We're really sad to hear about the death of Prince Philip, but it was a life well lived. He did a lot for um, for charity. Uh, Duke of Edinburgh Award, which Kitty is uh, completed. Yeah. So yeah, sad, it's heartbreaking news, I'd say. From the High Majesty of the Queen, her personal bodyguard, Count the Palace. I will serve Her Majesty the Queen, and Royal Highness will do all or take place two weeks' time. It will be a state new law. On behalf of His Royal Highness, the Duke of Edinburgh, who died early hours this morning at 9 o'clock. We will serve God until I die. God save the Queen! Oh, 